Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading so that we can take a look at the week ahead and see the ways that we can be really productive in this week's energy. The first card is Ten of Water, Family. The second card is Mystic of Earth, Frugality. The third card is Four of Fire, Home. The fourth card is Major 21, Wholeness. And the fifth card is Five of Fire, Challenge. So we're looking this week at how we can be productive in the week's energies. And we have a mix here of emotion and practicality and action. We begin the week by focusing on our family, whoever those people are that are closest in to us. We pay attention to those folks at the beginning of the week. We also are careful with our resources this week. Frugality says there's not a lot to use. You've got enough, but don't waste what you have. And this feels to me like it's physical, material resources this week. So pay attention to that. Just don't do any extra spending where you don't need to. In the middle of the week, our focus turns to home. This tells me that the productivity is at home at this point in the week. There's things that need to be tended to. Maybe the family needs to be brought back together in harmony. Maybe there's some repairs or just some general things that need to be done around home. But pay attention to that and get that taken care of. From home, we move into wholeness. So this tells me that as we begin the week, focusing in on our family and being careful with our resources and taking care of whatever needs to be done at home, we reach a level of wholeness that we've been looking for and that's very satisfying to us. Things feel complete. It feels like everybody's in place, everybody's satisfied, and we're all well connected. From wholeness, we move into challenge. Now, challenge says that something unexpected has come up that changes our plans a little bit. And this week, I'm going to pull an extra card and see what the general nature of that challenge is so that you can be prepared to meet it. And that challenge is flexibility. What that's telling me is that as you get things in place this week and tend to things at home and with family, there's a little bit of structure that comes into place that doesn't quite meet the needs of everybody who's involved. So whatever that structure is, whether it's agreements with each other, the way the house is built or arranged or um, times, time schedules, any of that kind of thing. Look at the places where it can be made more flexible because the inflexibility is going to create some problems somewhere along the line as you move into the following week. So in summary, pay attention to your family at the beginning of the week. Be careful with your material resources this week. Don't spend extra money. Just be cautious with things as far as, as being efficient instead of, instead of uh, wasting this week. Pay attention to home, take care of the things that need to be done there, and enjoy the wholeness that you step into. And know that at the end of the week, you're gonna face a challenge with flexibility. So this tells me that you need to make something in your life a little bit more easygoing than how you'd planned it. Let something become more flexible. Have a great week this week.